a little cleaner than when we moved in for sure. Made uh, hundreds of videos in this house. A couple of good ones too. Wish me luck, everybody. Goodbye, house. I've moved into my apartment last week and uh, finally have things basically organized. I've got three fans running throughout the apartment because uh, sometimes it does get fairly hot even though it's a basement apartment. Not too bad, but I am thinking of getting a little air conditioner probably in the next day or two. So let me show you around my apartment with all of my stuff in it. There's <clears throat> couch. Do, do, do. There's my uh, new, yes, I went out and bought a iPad. And it's funny, on Facebook somebody mentioned a laugh hold lamp, and I did buy one. It's not, it's not plugged in, but... Uh, I bought a lava lamp last week because I've never had one before and they are kind of cool. In the kitchen area, another fan. And there's where Jinxie likes to go sometimes. Hey Jinxie! Jinx! There's Jinxie, she's one of the puppets. She likes it up there sometimes. But she seems very comfortable here. She, what she does is she jumps here, up to the fridge, and up there. In the hallway, the long hallway that the cats like to chase each other down. A couple of uh, good sized closets. Your typical little bathroom and the uh, bedroom, or as I call it, the bedroom. And there is Mittens. Watch the way she walks. So cute. Because she's got... <laughs> Sweetie. So, I'm, I'm very comfortable here. Although, it could need the touch of a woman. Or, I'd like to touch a woman. <clears throat> well, here I am, still in the apartment, and ten years later. So, uh, my apartment at the moment is semi-clean, so I'll give you another tour. It'll be the first one in quite a few years. So, there's Middens. 
So one thing I did when I moved in was I, this is a old dresser there. So I flipped it around and cats look outside and they have a, an old cat tower. And many places to, to lay. Not that I spoiled them. And just some bins. My, uh, a lot of my box sets are in there. Some vinyl, old vinyl records. Most of them are like joke vinyl records. There's where Jinx, one of the many spots that Jinx loves to lay. Besides the back of my uh, chair. So, there's my computer. I'm uh, the skeleton that's usually hanging by over there. I'm thinking of doing some kind of special effects with that on my main channel. Uh, I'm really happy I bought this microphone for when I do live streams or videos with OBS Studio. It's excellent and it really kills off the uh, background noise like when I have my air conditioner on like I do now. Oh. She's scratching. Yeah. So, so it really hasn't changed <laughs> that much in 10 years. And, you know, it's never been painted or anything. Uh, they did, when I moved in, this was carpeted and uh, you know, kind of disgusting after a few years, but they did replace it with uh, wood flooring. Pretty cheap wood flooring, but, you know, it's better than the carpet I had and I've got the air conditioner going. I'm gonna do a video on for this channel and show you all of my Blu-rays and DVDs and talk about them. I thought that would make for a, a nice relaxing video. That's a, a plate that my friend Glenn Kellaway from the basement gave me. That's a card from John, not from John, from Yoko Ono and Sean Lennon. And they gifted me a couple of John Lennon box sets. Got a couple of those cards. That was nice. It's my son Michael and his wife Karen. That's the play I was in. Uh, when I moved to this apartment, I didn't have a job or anything. I've told the story on my main channel how after about a year I was really, you know, kind of depressed and I needed to do something besides get a job, of course. And so I did this play and it turned out to be a real confidence booster for me. And all my CDs. Another card. A stead muffin uh, from my buddy Glenn. Glenn's wife Lynn got that for me. And then that's just kind of all. I just stuck that all on for now. I'd like to have a nicer background at some point. My Sparks Brothers poster. Then uh, the kitchen hasn't really changed in 10 years. Uh, Definitely needs to be fixed up. There's my air conditioner. And another spot for the cats. To look outside. The hallway, I'm about to do some laundry. And But the bathroom is <laughs> really falling apart, so I'm not, you know, it's the, the wallpaper is, the, sorry, the painting, the paint on the walls is kind of falling apart, so. And then my bedroom, that's my blue screen and uh, green screen is on the other side. Bit of a mess. There's my winter tires for my car. There's my bed. 
uh, my CD player. This is where I usually listen to music with headphones. And bit of a mess. So that's it. That's the tour of Daddy's apartment. Yeah. And b before moving here, uh, Middens and Jinx lived in a house, a big house. I really, no, a good sized house. And so when they came here, you know, the first, the first day, they were pretty, you know, scared, I guess. And they would hide and hiss at hiss at each other and everything, but after a day or two, and also they, they weren't used to, you know, I live in an apartment building, so there's noises upstairs, always somebody walking around, so that kind of freaked them out for a, a few days. Freaked me out too. <laughs> uh, but it's been a good apartment for me. I have an awesome girlfriend, Molly, right? And you love Molly. And... This is the year where I'm, I'm going to be getting the heck out of this apartment. So, uh, but like I said, and also the the rent for this with heat and hydro, I think my rent is uh, seven eighty five a month, and that includes heat and hydro. So, it has definitely been a good, good spot for me. Right. You should get a job, though, right? You've been li living here rent-free for uh, for ten years. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, everybody, and have a great day. And thank you. Leave leave a comment below. I'd really appreciate it, and a thumbs up. And thank you.